Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Angela and today we are going to be having lunch together. This is another lunch date. Um, other people call these like mukbangs, but I'm just going to be calling them lunch dates because basically I'm having you guys come over, we're eating lunch, the dog doesn't want to be on camera, whatever. So if you guys don't know, this is my dog's Miss Snooky Louise. Um, she is a chocolate covered Shih Tzu. Yes, she's covered in chocolate because she's glorious. Anyway, um, yeah, so she's going to go back here and we are going to celebrate Oh Hanukkah. Today is the second day of Hanukkah. I don't know if they say like second day or second night or whatever. Let me rearrange you guys. Let's go over this way. Anyway, I'm a little bit slutty today. I have on my sports bra and it's going to be showing and I don't care. Um, anyway, Hanukkah. Today is the second day of Hanukkah and I believe at night you light the second candle. Now I don't have a, what is it called? A, men, a menorah or what? I don't have a menorah. So I'm just going to be lighting a two wick. Oh my God, you guys, this is so good. So this one is by Village Candle. It is a limited edition in the fragrance white cedar. That means um, forest cedar and bergamot together, but oh my God. Oh my God, so good. Oh, cleavage, just a little bit. Um, So we're going to light this puppy right now. And hopefully she will light. Ooh, she's lighting. She's lighting. Light up my life. Oh, my God. Ooh, she's going. She's going. So we're going to stick an illuminator on her um, and hope for the best. And I'm sure she will be glorious. Okay, so um, how are you guys doing? Me? I'm doing okay. I have to work on my water intake, which is why throughout this video, I'm going to be sipping on my Dunkin' Donuts water. I try to drink two of these a day, and I have been, well, today especially, was really, really busy at work. So I was only able to get one coffee down, um, and usually I have a coffee and then like three or four little, um, you know, water things or whatever, but Let's listen to the Hanukkah song. Is is this it? Oh, here we go. Happy Hanukkah. Okay, so there was our little Hanukkah song. We're all about the Hanukkah spirit and we're all about the Hanukkah life. Okay, so let me show you guys what I have for lunch today. I am so excited about the meal prep. Oh, look at the dog. I'm so excited, you guys, about the meal prep that I did today because it is zucchini, what is it called? Zucchini patties? I don't know. Let me look on Pinterest and see it. All I know is that this is probably the best vegan. I don't know if it's considered vegan or vegetarian, but there are eggs in here, so it's probably neither. And because it was vegan or vegetarian, I decided to put a little bit of cheese on there. So there is a little bit of uh, provolone going on in here. I think that's still vegan though. I mean, honestly, I feel as though it could still be um, vegan or vegetarian. So let me look to see what exactly these um, guys are called. I got this on Pinterest. They're called zucchini carrot fritters. And basically, they're made out of, um, oh, the cheese, you guys. They're made out of zucchinis, carrots, and chickpeas. I'm all about a good zucchini. And I don't know if you guys can see this. I have the roasted carrots. Um, these I put with um, coconut oil. I roasted them. And what else? Seasonings. Whatever. So good. And these patties. To die for. They have basil, garlic, Carrot, zucchini, chickpea. If you guys want the recipe, 
follow me on Pinterest. I'm AZ for Angela there. Mm. So good. So healthy for you. It's so refreshing to me to put like healthy food in my body. Instead of like all that crap that I was eating, like I just feel, mm, I don't know. I feel a little clean. You know what I mean? I just feel cleaner. And like all around, that's great. Mm. So you guys, we're getting so much snow right now. Um, at first I heard that we were only supposed to get three inches and then they changed it from three to six. And then from three to six, they went um, four to eight. And we did get maybe like a little dusting this morning, but now it's really coming down and I'm scared. Because this is the first year that I, the first winter really, the start of the first winter that I don't have Una, my minivan. So now I just have like a regular car and I live in Wisconsin and I'm scared about it. You know what I mean? But it is what it is, whatever. I mean, you know, you try your best and whatever you can't handle, give it to God. That's my new saying. Whenever I'm stressed out, and I don't believe in God, by the way, but whenever I'm stressed out, I always say, you know what? Nothing I can do about it. Give it to God. Give it to God. And it does make me feel better, you know. So I'm happy about that look at, mm, God. Mm. Mm. I am definitely making these again. I'm putting these on my list. So what else can we talk about? Mm. How's Snooki been? She's been great. Some people have been wondering how she's been doing. She's been doing really well. Um, Snooki turned seven on November 30th. So she is geriatric now. And she's doing great. I think she's going blind. But you know what? If that's the worst that can happen to an elderly dog who's seven, mm, she's thriving, you know? She's living the best life that she can possibly live. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm. I have to drink this water, you guys. Mm. Oh, my gosh. So, another update about MP. So, if you guys don't know, my mom had surgery. It's been a week now since she had the surgery. She saw the doctor on Monday. By the way, I'm filming this on Wednesday. I don't know what that means to you like but I'm just saying it I'm filming on a Wednesday probably gonna put this up on a Saturday or a Sunday yeah Sunday anyway and she saw the doctor and the doctor wants her to continue to not put pressure on that foot come back in a week he said and then he's going to put a hard cast on and then the real work starts the therapies the this the that She's still at the nursing home. Mm. You guys, I love carrots. When I was little, I would eat cans of carrots. Cans of carrots. Mm. There were two things in the world that I liked when I was little. Carrots and pickles. I would drink pickle juice. What does that mean? I must have been lacking in something, right? Like, maybe I had too much lead in my body. Right? Mm. I don't know what it means. Anyway, so like I said, it's snowing bad. I visited my mom every single day in the nursing home since she's been incapacitated or whatever you say. And last night... I was, I just got done visiting her. I came home. She says, Angela, I need my iPad. It's been a week without her iPad. I need my iPad. I just found out that they've got inter the internet's going on here. Because she doesn't understand Wi-Fi or anything like that. 
She says, I got the internets. I got the internets at the nursing home now. I said, mom, I'm already in my mumu. She said, Angela, can you go tomorrow? Well, now it's snowing and I don't know what to do. I mean, I don't want to danger myself. I'd have to take the lake road. You know what that lake road means. Hills and valleys right by the lake. I get so scared, you guys, on that lake road. Now, some of you longtime people who have been following me, I was periscoping one time on the lake road. I can't remember where I was going. All of a sudden, someone in front of me, I mean, I had the phone on a holder. Don't worry, I wasn't holding the phone. Anyway, someone in front of me hit a deer. The de Like, there's so many wild animals here in Wisconsin, and they just come to and fro. They jump in and out. A skunk, coyote, deer, werewolves, all of it. This deer came just darting out in front of this woman in front of me. She hit it. It went down in the middle of the road. Well, it's... Oh, I can't even talk about it. It was pregnant with twins and nobody, nobody survived. Is this a piece of hair? What was that? My food. Mm, it was cheese. No one survived. That's the road I have to take to get to her house. I can't do that to a mother and the babies. I don't know if I'm going to be able to go today. And oh, she's going to be mad about it. But there's nothing I can do about it. I don't want to put myself in danger. And I'd have the dog with me. And we don't want to do that either. Anyway. I don't know what else really is going on. Mm. You guys, this is so good. What about the election in Alabama? You guys, honestly, I literally, like, when I think about that kind of stuff that's going on in Alabama and, like, actually all across the world because it's happening everywhere, these goddamn pedophiles, I swear to God, you guys, I feel like they're putting something in milk or they're putting something in eggs or they're putting something in some food or the environment or something for people to go cuckoo crazy and think that it's okay that any pedophile could run run whatever, run a state, run a nation, run, well, look at the president. We're going to leave that where it is, but you guys all know my views. And then, supposedly, they pulled the state of Alabama. You know, the people. Um, it was either 52 or 53 of the people in the state of Alabama that were voting said that if the person they were voting, or if, if a person running was a pedophile, that didn't affect them. That would not affect their decision. I mean, um, they wonder why human trafficking is a problem right now, you know? And they wonder why all these kids getting taken and abducted is a problem right now. Well, when you got the president saying that it's okay to grab anyone's, anybody's crotch, that's what's going to happen. Mm. I wasn't going to talk about it because... I know it is kind of like a sensitive, you know, subject, whatever. But, nonetheless, it's what's going on in the United States. The land of the free. The free to do whatever you want, I guess. Mm. So, um, my meal prep made two patties plus the carrots all for... 250 calories. That's a pretty good deal. Mm. I gotta drink this water. Okay, let's see. Where's the line? Right here. Mm. 
You guys, I'm really good at drinking water fast. I know it's probably not a good situation, but let's try it. down to here oh my stomach hurts I can't do it anymore okay well you guys I'm gonna finish my lunch thank you guys so much for watching today and having this little lunch date with me we'll have to do it again soon because I love having you guys over it's amazing and yeah we'll talk about other things you know if there are topics that you want us to talk about during lunch date Leave a com oh, I just burped. Leave a comment down below and let me know if there are any other topics that you would like to discuss. Because, you know, we can talk about whatever, but I will see you guys all later, and I hope everyone has a fabulous day. Bye, everyone.